but what's going on guys, it's Zimbro here, and today we have a little bit of a different video. It's another opening, but it's with souvenir cases. No, I didn't get a cobblestone case, because personally I think that's overpriced as fuck. Yeah, I know you can get a dragon lore, but the chances are slim to none. And the souvenir dragon lore is worth a lot. It's like, John, how much is it worth back in here? It's worth like 10,000, yeah? Like 30. It's a lot of money. So, um, you know, dragon lore is shit ton. You can buy that cobblestone thing for 30 bucks. I don't think it's very much worth it. We're going to start with, like, the worst case and then go down. Or maybe I'll just open these yellow dolo. Hopefully we can get a freaking, uh, masterpiece. That'd be sick if we got a souvenir masterpiece. But this is just kind of for fun. This only costed, uh, how much did this cost? Like, 25 bucks maybe for this case opening thingy we're doing here? I think it's about 25. Yeah, 25, hey. yeah. Uh, Ember, if you get a souvenir masterpiece, you know, I'll keep it warm for you. Oh, yeah? I feel you. Okay, we're going to get the worst one first, which I think is the Dust 2 one. I think. Nope, actually, yeah. it's the Inferno one. The Inferno one's the worst. Right. So we're going to open that one first. Um, I think it'd be really cool if we got a M4A4 Tornado. That'd be pretty sweet. If that in fact renewed, that'd probably be worth a decent bit. Tech 9 Brass. I don't really care what we get here, honestly. Here we go. Before Anything's fine. Factory. Um, looks like we're gonna get a souvenir walnut if it's in good condition. I'm gonna keep these, by the way. I'm probably not gonna sell them unless I get something worth a lot. Wow, this actually looks really nice. Holy crap. Um, Wait, Andrew. it's battle. <laughs> I was like, this is really nice, and it's a battle scarred. Who's it signed by, though? Hang on. Can't see. Me. It's signed by an envious team. Oh, Kiyoshima. Is it Kiyo? Kiyoshima? Yeah, I think so. I think that's who signed that one. Let's go see how much that's worth real quick. So on the market. Um, it's worth about 25 cents, so I'm going to keep it anyway. Um, I, pr I wish I'd kept one of my other souvenir items open a while back, but souvenir items I'm definitely probably going to keep and hold on to. Um, okay, so next off we're going to grab the next worst case, which is probably the Dust 2 one. Um, out of this, here's the lovely Sand Dune collection. If I get a, a PT-50 Sand Dune, I will actually love that. I might actually use it. I love the Sand Dune, it's just so... It's just so It's known. so simple, but it's such a nice skin. If it's in fact new, it looks sick. So here we go. Opening up this bad boy here. Oh, We're going to get... It actually looks really cool. Oh, we... oh, wow, we almost got an M4A1S Very Camo. That would have been pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. Holy crap. We got a Souvenir Scar Sand Mesh. It looks pretty disgusting. It's got the Fanatic and Envious stickers on it, which is pretty cool. It's got Pronax that signed it, so that's pretty cool. Um, let's see how much that's worth. These are probably... We're probably going to get garbage from all of these, but this is just for fun. I kind of want to collect some... Holy crap. 17 cents, yeah. Um, that's not, oh, that not coming. That, that's not too great. <laughs> okay. Next, we're going to grab the... Let's see, what's, what's the next worst one? I guess it'll have to be either the train or Mirage. I guess we'll go for the train. Open this bad boy up. Um, hey, uh, Andrew, hmm. you know what 5.7 skin actually looks pretty cool? Which one? Oh, crap. Yeah, Contractor. Contractor? Like now? Oh, yeah. We got a souvenir dual British colony. They look pretty scratched up. Uh, this is actually signed by Krems, so that's pretty cool. Uh, this is ALG versus Fnatic, which is an easy peasy game. Uh, field tested condition, not too terrible to see. This is probably worth a couple cents as well. Let's find out how much these are worth. Um, about 40 cents or so. You know, eh, not too great. Um, next, we're going to open up the Mirage. Let's see what we got here. Um, oh, man, some of these. Okay, a UMP 45 would be great. That could make back what I've spent. Um, a Mag 7 Bulldozer, that could be a lot if I get Fac New. Um, a Hot Rod, that'd be pretty sweet. Groundwater would be pretty sweet. And and then the Contractor, if that's Fac New, that'd be pretty sweet. So, let's see what we get from this one. We're going to grab a, a Souvenir P250 Bone Mask. Maybe in good condition. Um, looks pretty scratched up. It's... Who, who the hell... LG versus Fnatic again. An LG member signed it, and I don't know who. Cold. Oh, it's cold. Okay, it's cold. Sign that one. This is in. How are these all bad? Oh man, this is horrible. This one's in battle scarred condition, but it doesn't look that bad actually. Fifty-seven cents. Yeah, this isn't too shabby. Um, okay, so now we're gonna do the ESL one cash collection. This one's pretty sweet. I honestly don't care what I get from this one. I just really don't want a P250 contamination. Um, I'd be really happy with a PP Bison Chemical Green Factor New, that'd be pretty sweet. Any of the blues, um, and the purples of course, the Cer uh, Cerberus would be sweet. So, we're going to open up this one. So far it's so good. Um, oh, we just saw a purple pass by, and we're going to grab a SG Fallout Warning. Please be in good condition, it doesn't look too bad in the picture, but it's probably- Oh my god, it actually looks really nice. Um, this one is signed by Kiyoshima, again I guess Kiyoshima loves us, and this is the Envious vs TSM game. 
I'm not sure how much this is going to be worth. Hopefully a decent price. Maybe. Maybe not. Probably not. Um, about a dollar. Wow, this looks a lot better than... Feel, it's field tested too. It looks a lot better than field tested in my opinion. If you look at this right here, it's got some scratches down below, but that's about it on this thing. This thing is not bad at all. I'm, I don't know why it's so low. I think it should be worth more, but that's just me. Okay, so last we got our overpass one. Um, honestly, I just don't want any of these ugly grays. Because this is a pretty, this is really not one of the, this is just, eh, this could be really bad or really, really nice. The masterpiece would be sweet. I'd be happy with a nitro, a detour, any, really anything, a blue, purple, or pink. Um, a Desert Eagle Urban would be pretty sweet. Block Knight would be cool, but I really don't want any of these. I'll probably get one of those ugly uh, consumer grade items. So hopefully we'll get something decent out of this one. And looks like we're going to pick up a, oh, please, please give me the Knight. Oh my gosh, we're going to get a, we're gonna get a scorched UMP 45 scorched, and it looks to be in decent condition, but it's probably somehow battle scarred or something. This is the Mouse versus Cloud Nine game, and it's signed by Dennis on Mouse. So um, we really didn't get. It really wasn't that great of an opening. I might do souvenir unboxings more often, just because they're kind of fun to do. Uh, I know you. We usually don't, and probably will never get anything good out of them. But they're fun to do, and they're really not that expensive if you pick the right kind of cases. If you get a cobblestone case, obviously it's going to be a bit overpriced, but these aren't too bad. They're like $2 each. It's just like opening a case, but you're not going to get anything good out of it, but maybe a nice souvenir item with a cool signature on it if you get the newer ones. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe for daily CSGO content, and leave any feedback in the comment section below. And if you have a video suggestion, leave that down there too. See you guys in the next video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.